okay. Yeah, so you throw your dagger at the other thing, and um, you don't manage to get it quite in the eye, but you do catch it in the cheek, um, and it, it, it uh, takes a solid chunk of it out of its face. Okay. Uh, anything else on your turn? Nope, that's all I can do, I'm afraid. Okay. Okay, we're gonna step past Zorn. That's his name, I knew it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got there eventually. I'm gonna try to hit it. <laughs> that's the sound it made. It mm -hmm. did. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't used it before, so... <laughs> it's got some dust on it, you gotta rub off. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, new 40 Little bolts. <laughs> <laughs> you can streaking forward and, you, and it catches it uh, sort of in the hip. Um, uh, looks to do some damage, um, but it's still doing pretty alright. And then I'll skip it. <laughs> <laughs> like a chicken. <laughs> Good choice, Bree! That's it for you, Bree? Yeah. Derek, you're up. Dead. Um. Yeah, you know what? We'll die next turn, probably. Um. Let's take down the arrow. And then. Gonna shoot him! Um, so you pull an arrow out of your out of your quiver, knock release, it goes streaking forward and catches him right under the collarbone, um, or what you imagine the equivalent of a collarbone is, and you see just sort of this um, grayish, uh, dark acre sort of spew out, um, and it you hear like a loud sort of screeching moan, just this. <laughs> um, it appears to still be on its feet, but it's not looking good. Yes. Anything else from you, Garrett? Garrett's, Garrett's gonna go to the guard and just say, pound his head into paste for us. Well, let's see, if, let's see if that even works. <laughs> Alright, so I look it square in the eye. It's within two. Right? Yeah, okay. And I'm gonna say, it's time for you to go back to hell. And I run straight up to it, and I'll whack it with my hammer. Come on, do stuff, do stuff. Ah. Uh, yep, that'll do. Um, so yeah. you bring, you bring your hammer, you run straight forward, just wielding it in one hand, and you stretch back and bring it down, and you crush his skull into powder. Yes. And it collapses yeah. to the ground. Very I dead. spit on the corpse. Get my blood well, I mean, for you, will ya? Seems unnecessary. Guys, I hate undead. <laughs> I mean, I get, I get that. Is, there, is that the end of initiative? That is the end of initiative. Okay. <laughs> Killing blow. Now that we've murdered everything, what kind of skeletons are they? Uh, they are not skeletons. They're, They're zombies. Flash. They're not zombies either. Ooh. Um, you can make. I'll say, uh, let me look, what kind of check I want you to make this, um, athletics, no, damn, you can survival. make, if it helps my absolute worst is insight, straight intelligence, nature, or arcana, or oh, sorry, not nature, straight intelligence, religion, or arcana, hey, religion, I'm good at that, oh, cool, I have proficiency or arcana, we're gonna do that, anybody, or just, oh. hey, uh, whoever's looking, so at that point with those, you guys know, um, one of these was a ghast, and the other was a ghoul. Ooh. Ooh. I don't like either of those things. <laughs> um, if I wanted to use Sacred Flame to burn the bodies, would that count as a spell slot? Uh, uh, Sacred Flame's a cantrip. You're right. I'm stupid. Hey. So, no. No, it wouldn't. we have an entire party who all have Der Derek Derek quickly <laughs> pulls his arrow and Bree's bolt from the zombie, or whatever the hell it is, mm -hmm. right as he. <laughs> it's just like, die! <laughs> Before he burns them to pieces. 
Yes. I, um, I burned both pieces. Who okay. asked? No. So you burn them both to cinders. Good. Oops, that was a that was a good choice, man. That was just a couple of like piles of ash next to this pile of bone. So uh, we should probably burn those ashes. Garrett Gar takes the arrow that has the, uh, that's in the pillar out and okay. just kind of holds it, so he has his own light. Okay. Let me give you that. Hey, 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 it's a smart call, but... Um, you find your dagger, no. Bless. It, yeah, it, it's right next to the, uh, the, the burnt, crispy body. Oh dear. Flips it, puts it back in her belt. It's me. Derek smirks. Rogue, nimble fingers. Do I have... Ooh, interesting. Arrow? Uh, yeah, I gave you... Uh, I, no, you didn't, because I can't do anything with it. I didn't and I give you permission for the thing, I just gave you 24 vision on your person. Oh! Gotcha. Those are the best of Those are the best of so, there's a walkway over here, there's another one to the north. Which one should we take? I don't know. Do we, do we really want to keep going deeper into this thing? We have to figure out what caused that stuff to come up, to go up there, or else it's going to happen again. Yeah, but I mean... Can we do any of us even have the thing to know the way out? Alright, there are we some are Yeah. Like, they're not exactly known for having street maps. Mel and, uh, Jean, as you guys yes. say, that tunnel that you see on the right, can you actually see that, Jean? I don't know. The one straight ahead? Yeah, the one, yes. the one that leads up to the right. Yes. You see, that doesn't appear to be carved out as, as, like the other ones, it's not nice, and in fact, on the ground, there are, like, sort of stones and bones laying there, like it's recent, um, and it appears to be, like, coming up at an angle, and it's smaller than most of the other tunnels. Uh, guys, we need to check this out. What is it? I don't know, it looks like someone dug their way into the catacombs, from even lower. Huh, that's weird. Yeah, I can't see. <laughs> um, as we guys are too far, I'm gonna go, like, look over here quick. Hold on, time out real quick. As you guys look down uh, that passageway, you can tell it does begin to narrow. It doesn't appear to get to a point where you wouldn't fit in it, but it does look like the taller folk of you would be uncomfortable and might have to punch. Do you want the small one to scout ahead? She wiggles her fingers. What is Noren doing? Noren is looking around the corner because he saw a different passageway. And he's going to yell back, Hey guys, hold on a sec. There's a corner. Oh, I'm, I feel I like this is more suspicious. So we can go yeah, down and look here and then we can go back over there. If it doesn't Noren, what you see in the angle here, right there, there, that, mm -hmm. that rectangle there, is a raise about three or four foot off the ground maybe seven and a half feet long, two feet wide, stone Mimic. coffin. <laughs> hey guys. Last time we went off on our own, we found really cool chests. There's a really big coffin over here. And, like, the, the good kind of coffin, not the breeze hiding in this kind of coffin. Open it. I know you. There'd be good stuff inside. There was last time. I um, disagree. Wait, stuff? Things? Pretty bubbles? Okay, last, in all fairness, last time it did try to eat us. That was really cool. I, we have different standards. <laughs> it was cute. Okay. Jean, you walk about ten feet into the tunnel. You have walked about ten feet into the tunnel. 
the the walls are just earth around you. They don't appear to be reinforced with anything, though they do appear to be fairly sturdy. Um, but there's no there's no like holes for bodies in these walls, and it's more almost like circular with a flat bottom, like half sphere, rather than square. Like no no like sharp angles in this tunnel. All right. Um, can I take out my crossbow, cast light on a bolt, and shoot it down the hallway? Go for it. All right, so take that out. Really? You really gonna steal that from me? Well, I—that's my tactic. Okay, I do that all the time. It's a good idea. That's an amazing idea. I can't believe that nobody else came up with it before you did. It was right. I'm you say you take this bolt and you fire it um, down the down the tunnel. It looks the same the whole flight of the bolt. It it does narrow um, to a point where you re you recognize that you probably have to hunch over to walk through it. Um, but otherwise, it, it, nothing changes. Okay, I'll head back to the group then. Okay. Fair, Gary. Also, you can do it on your own anyway. Yeah, I came up with that thing, alright? Paul Deer does the opposite. He throws darts and casts darkness on them. Like a boss. Man, as you move in here, there is a, the coffin is a fairly plain stone coffin. Um, no distinguishing marks, but hanging on the wall behind it, and you notice in this alcove, there are no, the walls are flat. There are no, uh, spaces for other bodies, right? Like there are on all the other walls. On the wall behind this coffin, you see a silver shield hanging, um, shaped like sort of the stereotypical, uh, flat on top, curving down to a point at the bottom, and on it is what appears to be a... Um, some sort of uh, sigil um, that has the, the head of a dragonborn um, featuring prominently. Hmm. Would I have any idea what that was? Uh, what, the sigil? Yeah, do I recognize what it looks like in any way? You could conceivably roll a history check for this. I'm going to do that. Would a religion check do anything? No. A religion check would not help. Um, I'm athletics. Shut up. Um, <laughs> <laughs> history? Gotcha, you don't recognize this sigil at all. Uh, yes, Derek, you may also roll history if you'd like. Ooh. Could I roll history? Sweet car wheel. Yes. Uh, you may also roll history. Derek, you don't recognize this sigil. Damn. No, yeah, wow. recognize yes. this sigil. I'll give it a shot with my whopping plus zero. I've got a plus two. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> hey! 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 You should push it. Oh. Or actually, more to the point, no one should push it, and I'm going to mage hand push it from a safe blast radius. If you think it's, if you think it's got defenses, I can handle it. I'm not hoping it would open well, up something. Yeah, I guess you, you can, probably would be good at that. Can, can you check it for traps to see if there's anything? Put away his mage hand. Can I check it for traps? Um, if you'd like to get up close to it, sure. Sneaky. Are you sure you don't want me to mage hand at this? Like, I can poke it from 30 feet away. We wouldn't even get close. All right. She's checking. <laughs> the world thinks they're shinies. Yeah, while she's checking. Son of a bitch! You don't see anything that looks like a trap, so far as you can tell. Alright, well then, if you want to mage hand it, feel free. Mm. Just looking down sadly at the mage hand, just lying on the ground. No, no, no. Do you think one mage hand would do it, or do you think it needs more force than just a single mage hand? I mean, wait, did you actually do it? No, no, I didn't do anything. Major is just laying on the ground sadly right now. So I haven't 